We're gonna need the blood from a demon older than him. Sarah thought that the Holy Lance had tremendous power over Mortimer. I'm going to try to find it. I'm going to pretend I didn't understand what that implies. Go on. Meanwhile, I... Yeah. Si you found the lance. I don't know where to begin, and, and time is running out. It's hard for me to help. Where did you last see it? Well, Napoleon took it from me. That's where I would start. Yes, you're right. He didn't know what it was. He might still have it. You had better check. Make haste. You really must lay your hands on it, Louis. An object that touched the blood of Christ. It's not the kind of thing you come across every day. Think hard. I have faith in you. Right. Let's see if we can find it. You really must lay your hands on it, Louis. Oh, there's a servant. Just my luck. I'll have to be quick and discreet. Mr. Bonaparte is not available. I must ask you to please... What's wrong with him? Uh, he is feeling faint. He will make a swift recovery with some calm and rest. I shan't beat around the bush, my good fellow. I have every reason to believe that Monsieur Bonaparte has betrayed your master's trust, but I still need to find the proof by inspecting his personal effects. So I'd be much obliged if you would stand out of my way. I say, sir, that is a grave accusation. My master knows and appreciates Monsieur Bonaparte. You're questioning Lord Mortimer's faith in me, if I understand rightly? Well, I'm sure he'll be delighted to find that out. But I... It is true that Sir has recently helped my master a good deal, and come, Sir, as you obey Lord Mortimer. What's the matter? You seem to be a bit troubled all of a sudden. Have you noticed anything out of the ordinary? I... Yes, indeed, Sir. I remember being surprised by an object. I found something in Napoleon's effects. A lance head. Just what I thought. Well done, my friend. Your master will be proud of you. I shall tell him that you... Have you a name? Well, it, it, it's just that... A number? Maybe a letter? <laughs> no matter. He'll be proud. Anyway, I must lay my hands on that lance and give it back to Lord Mortimer. Keep an eye on him while I search, and don't hesitate to knock him out should he wake up. Very well, sir. That is precisely why I'm here. I believe I know what he's suffering from. I need to examine him, but, but it won't take long. Sir, I... <laughs> yes, of course. I shall let Sir have a few moments with him in that case. You're most kind. Look, as well as being a fellow countryman, Napoleon is above all a dear friend. I... Uh, of course, Sir. I, I, I was not aware... I think it's perfectly natural for me to be worried, and for you to let me go to him. Uh, oh, yes, Sir. I, I was not aware, Sir. Um... Uh, I shall let you be with him a few moments in that case, sir. Thank you, my good man. The Holy Lance. Luckily, Napoleon couldn't put it back in its place. No, stop! Oh! Oh! <laughs> my son! You will regret your actions when you see him. Come, Louis. It's over. Let's leave. You go on. I'll meet you on the wharf. Congratulations, my son. You had a backup plan. Well, I did learn from the best. I've done it. It worked. If 
only you hadn't gotten the wrong lance. I do wish you didn't have to turn out this way, you know. If only you hadn't poisoned yourself. Anyway, don't blame yourself. You fought like the devil right up to the very end. You can be proud of yourself. <coughs> it's not fair! You can't always win, Louis. What a waste. No, stop! Oh. Oh. <laughs> My son! And to think you did all that for nothing. What do you mean, Louis? <laughs> Didn't he tell you? He was poisoned several days ago. He was condemned. He sacrificed himself for us. What a pity he got the wrong lance. Uh, oh, what have you done to me? I hope you aren't in a hurry, my daughter, because you are going to die here. <sighs> Don't expect any of the family to come to my place in the ether to bring you back this time. <laughs>